haven't made a video in ages so forgive me if I'm a bit rusty here. But this is how my first Gundam build went. Well technically this isn't my first because in my previous video I built one in the mall food court. But that was with a friend. This is my first time building a Gundam solo. I was lucky enough to hear the staff member of the toy store say Ariel and I quickly rushed to the gun plus section where I managed to get my hands on the high grade 1144 scale Ariel from Witch from Mercury which is an anime I highly recommend by the way because girls in it. Anyways this was the last they had in stock and Ariel is very hard to find. Online it would cost $30 or even more so thank god I found one in the toy store for about $18. Now before the hardcore Gunpla fans dies of cringe or ask for my head, let me just say again this is my first time building a plastic model kit. The build itself was very fun and quite nice. I did buy some nippers beforehand so that helped a lot because I didn't want to manhandle my Gundam. The pieces easily snapped on together, the only difficulty I found really was with the stickers. I couldn't for the life of me get them to the proper spot, it would take me about 10 minutes or so and I even managed to stab myself with a toothpick one time. It also didn't help that my hands were sweating because it's like 40 degrees here in the Philippines. The instructions were easy to follow, I was just a dumbass sometimes. Overall, it was very simple and enjoyable to build. It took me about 3 hours to finish building it, and here it is without any paint or basic panel lining whatsoever. And I think it still looks pretty good. This model is such amazing eye candy. It's gorgeous and very accurate to the show. It's also very sturdy and built like a rock. It has no loose joints and can be easily posable. It can even stand on its own while doing a pose without a stand. I know I'm using a stand in the pictures here but trust me it can still hold it without one. Lastly, aside from doing multiple poses, you can pose it with different accessories. It has of course the beam rifle and two beam sabers. It also has the shield which can be disassembled and put onto the Gundam. As for my final thoughts, I am very much terrified because I want to buy more Witch from Mercury model kits and this feels like the beginning of an addiction. I also heard a lot of good stuff about the kits so let me know if you want to see me build more plastic robots or what content you'd like me to do next. That's pretty much it, see ya.